guys, welcome back to the Shannon Share. Hello, if you're new, so today's video is going to be a reaction of Conversations with Friends episode one. I hope everybody is doing as well as can be, and I really do hope everybody is being as proactive as possible and supporting the Black Lives Matter movement. And if you're still on the lookout for some resources, I've linked some in the description. Feel free to comment down below your thoughts on my commentary. I'm always up for a chat, I'm always up for a debate. And if you like this video, give it a thumbs up. And if you didn't give it a dislike, no hard feelings. And if you really, really like this video, consider subscribing and helping your girl out. So, so conversations with friends episode one so this is another sally rooney adaption obviously normal people her first adaption was quite popular i watched it i enjoyed it was a bit depressing but it was a good watch so i'm here for more sally rooney content i didn't really look into what this was about i haven't read any of sally rooney's books i probably will go back and read the normal people book now that we're not going to get a second season second season but from what i've seen from the earliest reviews it's meant to be just as good as normal people i hope it's not as depressing with these reactions there's only a limited amount of footage that i can use on youtube so if you want the full unrestricted reaction experience check out my patreon and on patreon you can also send me direct requests as well so let's get into it shall it all right glasses headphones let's fucking go Here's a riddle. I am inherently worthless, but highly prized. I will empty out your bank account. Okay, she's a material girl. Let's get back to the library. Okay. I don't. Mm hmm. Off you fuck then. <laughs> hey, Wally. Bye. Now, oh, set in Ireland again. I read in the description she's at Trinity College. Isn't that where the people with normal people went as well? Nailed it. Good shit. I think so. <laughs> hey, hey. <laughs> How do you feel? Okay. Yay, summer. <laughs> yeah, summer is always better. Um, I always side eye people who say that they like winter better than summer. Elevated to the status of dominatrix. Haven't, Haven't you heard? heard? Buckle up, this is the next wave of female, female empowerment. empowerment. Oh, they do slam poetry. I've always wanted to go to one of those things. The last one where we reclaimed the pole and learned to dance better on it. Good, Good for, for exercise. exercise. I mean, it is in theory, in terms of actual muscle. Oh, it's feeling very anti-sex work. Other girlies, swerve it. The writer. Huh? That's kind of you to say. Yes, girl, get out here and network. For muse. Well, I want to muse. I don't operate exclusively. Oh, okay, girl. We started in school. We were fucking back then too, but we don't do that anymore. I, I thought they were fucking, but the way that they were looking at each other on the couch. Not the fucking, but kept the poetry. That sounds like the wrong way around. I know, right? I mean, it happens. Look at this little baby city. I do love living by the sea. So I took my ass back. Yeah? Put your number in my phone. Okay, girl. Yes. Oh, the seagulls. When I lived in Brighton, the seagulls were rude in the morning. Very rude. Is this the Taylor Swift boyfriend everyone's talking about? I swear that's meant to be her love interest, though. Is she going to steal her husband? Ooh, girl. Kind of want to see it. My messy ass kind of wants to see it. <laughs> you do it every day. Just about. <laughs> well, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> the Irish Sea. What fucking do? Do you guys? Do any of you guys like swimming in the sea? I just feel like the sea just smells so stinky. You can just throw your shit there. Ooh. That's fine. I'm gonna. Mm, I love the velour tracksuit. Help yourself to whatever you'd like. Um, can I do anything? No, no, just relax. Oh, Nick should be back soon. The husband. But go ahead, you're gonna go shower, bitch, after jumping in the stinky sea. I'm judging you. Books everywhere. I really wanted to have a really good book collection, but I've only managed to like 
have two books on my shelf so far. I don't even have a shelf. I don't even know what I'm talking about, but two books in my collection. Bobby's from New York. Oh, right. Yeah, it was a bit of a culture shock at first. There are a lot of white people here. Yes. Is Miss Sally being self-aware? Don't be looking for no POCs now. I said this is a white town. Nick's the only person I know whose parents are still in love. Mm. And quite demonstrative. Uh, yeah. It's quite uncomfortable to be around. Is she the girl, the, the teacher in sex education? I feel like that's her. I might be wrong. Maybe, in a sense. It depends. I mean, obviously, the really good ones are more than that. The rest of us are just grinding it out on the production line. I mean, you are. She's not wrong about that. But OK, girl, come round. That was really delicious. Thank you. Oh, he's the one who cooked it. I know people always say that. The play is fine. It's not a very bold choice. Cat and Martin Roof. I feel like he's very unsatisfied with his life. It's melodrama. Which isn't, you know, it's not a dig, I'm not... People say that, don't they, in a disparaging way, but I mean... Yeah. I don't mind the melodrama if it's done well. You're being polite. Uh, no, I just I really like to see it. Yeah, if I take your email, I'll sort it out. OK, he's given her tickets. I mean, I don't do anything about it at all. Uh, which must make me sound... No, not at all. I mean, what can you do when you're living in this fucking capitalist society, Han? What can you really do, Han? Because, <laughs> let me tell you, the revolution is not coming. Yeah, most of us just kind of swim around in a pretty aimless, comfortable... Um... I feel like I get what he's saying. Most of us are comfortable being slaves to the system because the plantation isn't that bad anymore. People grow up, get married, have babies. Yeah. Boring people. Boring people who then get a fucking divorce. I mean, divorces can be interesting, you know? You have a crush on her. <laughs> yeah. Obviously, I have a crush on her. Yeah it's, yeah, it's obvious. I thought he was funny. He barely opened his mouth. Yeah, he wasn't funny. But he was awkward and cute. So I know that she's thirsting for him, Loki, because he's sweet and he's sensitive and he gets her. Holding a conversation that lasts longer than two minutes. I mean, who knows what happens between two people when they're alone? Yeah, what's going to happen between them when they're left alone? I want to know. <laughs> and we use that as a test of cultural excellence. Don't get excited. You write it, I read it, and if you happen to have an undiscovered genius in that pile... I mean, girl, you knew what the job was when you signed up, honey. Till the song goes down. Oh, she's gone to the play. I mean, of course she's gone to the play. He's on the floor and crawl. Here, take it. Take it. <laughs> take it. So what kind of accent, girl? They should have cast someone else for her, bro. She's waiting at the bar. Yeah. I mean, the thing is, it... It, that could definitely be innocent, but it's not innocent for her, is she? Because she said that's it for him. She chickened out, but she sent him a text. He's going to text her back. He texted her back. Interesting. Now, now he wants to come to her show. <sighs> Just having bad cramps. I feel you, sis. Lately, my cramps have been really bad. She's still there, honey. That must be real bad. Yeah. <laughs> Sorry. Okay. 
Oh, she's nervous because he's going to be there. Oh, I see. <laughs> she's looking around for him. Highly priced. We'll empty out your bank account. But what they did do, and we'll quote from their report here, which is much better than anything we could ever make up. All of these lectures revolve. Oh, she's seen him. And if a diamond's a thing, put it on a ring, but don't sing to me about love being enshrined in its class. I won't be your audience. I'm out of your grasp. Yeah, a diamond ring definitely doesn't mean love, but like, I'm gonna take the diamond ring. <laughs> Thank you. Hey, hold on. Thanks. You want to buy me a drink? Yeah, of course. Be my pleasure. Okay, girl. Don't you feel a bit conflicted? Just generally, or you're playing a gay character and you're a straight man. Is Brick gay? <laughs> She's just always gonna rip into him, isn't she? Craft you an email. It'll be full of compliments. This is kind of cute there, even though it's very traveling. It won't require us to make eye contact. We could try it though. Mm. Yeah. She looks so innocent. She, she looks like traveling. <laughs> hey. See, he's not happy in his life, but really not happy with his marriage either. And now he's seeking the attention of a younger girl. Hmm. Hmm, 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 hmm. But I'd be interested to hear from you guys. What are you thinking about the developments of this relationship? Do you think it's a bit dodgy? Are you low key here for it? I'd be interested to hear from you guys. And yeah, what did you think about the episode? As always, let me know what you thought about my commentary. And I'd be interested to hear from people who have read the book. So far, are you liking the direction of the series or not? Let me know. But yeah, I'd be open to reacting to the series. I'm probably just going to wait and see how this video does. If you really do want to see the reactions continue, be sure to interact with this video, like, comment, share. It really helps the video out, especially since the algorithm doesn't want to help you get out. And you can always send me a direct request on Patreon to guarantee a reaction. Subscribe if you haven't yet, and if you have, don't forget to my notification bell on so you know my next video is dropping. I'm also trying to get you 4.2k subscribers. That's my next short-term goal, and I'd appreciate if you help me out with that goal. And thank you to everybody who has subscribed to my channel so far, and thank you to everybody who's taken in the extra step to sign up to my patreon it really means a lot to me till next time guys bye